Section 3.3 .3, Polar Molecules A molecule cannot be polar if it has a center of inversion. For example, in this molecule, we have a center of inversion. This methyl goes to here, this bromine goes to here, this chlorine goes to here. The reason is very simple. If there is a dipole moment, and then this dipole moment, no matter what the direction is, after you do a inversion, the sign of the dipole moment should change, right? I mean, with respect to the center of the inversion. However, if you look at the molecule, the structure doesn't change. So this method goes here, this problem goes here. You can't see the difference. So the same molecule with all atoms in the same position, and then its dipole moment has changed. How is that possible? Same molecule, same structure, all atoms in the same position. Now, after this inversion, well, all atoms are still in their original positions. And then you have the sign of the dipole moment changed. There's only one possible explanation. The dipole moment is zero. So after inversion, the sign changes. It's negative zero. And then zero is equal to negative zero. A molecule cannot have a electric dipole moment perpendicular to any mirror plane. So if you look at this CH2O, this formaldehyde, does this molecule have a dipole moment? Yes, of course, along the z direction. But look, it cannot have a electric dipole moment perpendicular to any mirror plane. So there, there are two mirror planes here, right? Neither is perpendicular to the dipole moment I'm talking about here. The reason is very simple. If there is a dipole moment perpendicular to a mirror plane, okay, that's fine. And then you can just do a reflection with respect to that mirror plane. After the reflection, again, all atoms in the molecule should be, you know, in the same positions, right? So you just, yes, it's true, you may have to kind of swap this 200 atoms if you are doing a reflection with respect to this sigma V plan, but you cannot tell the difference. The same atoms, the same kind of atoms, will be in the same positions. But at the same time, since you are doing a reflection, so supposedly if you have a dipole moment perpendicular to the mirror plan, its sign should change, right? Its sign should change. And then, well, at the same time, we want to say, well, it, it, it remains unchanged. The dipole moment should remain unchanged. Again, you can only say, well, this dipole moment is zero. And zero is equal to negative zero. Uh, same argument here. A molecule cannot have an electric dipole moment perpendicular to any axis of rotation. Well, except for C1. C1 is a rotation by 360 degrees. So any other rotations, if you do a rotation, if the electric dipole moment is perpendicular to that rotation, the direction of the dipole moment will change. All right? And at the same time, well, again, the same kind of atoms appear in the same positions in the molecule after the rotation. So its dipole moment should not change. So again, it should change, and then it should not change. Well, the only possible explanation is, well, this dipole moment is just zero.